What's happening, everybody? Bregadan here. We are back with more Shovel Knight, Spectre of Torment. Uh, we left off last time killing out Pride More Keep and finishing off the uh, King Knight. Next time, we're going to go to Lost City and take on Mole Knight. Uh, so let's go uh, get right into it. Um, you saw me struggle a little bit uh, with some of the jumping puzzles in the last one. They were a bit challenging. This one also um, not terribly easy, but adds a couple new mechanics into the uh, mix. I can also admit to you guys, I have never gotten all the skulls in this one, though I've played this map before, like, twice, so... I've got nine, so I'm gonna keep an eye out, hopefully I can get the last one, and I just botched that crap. Right, not a huge deal, whatever, we got this. Alright, so obviously the green stuff makes you bounce, just like the last Shovel Knight, but this also, when you hit it, you push back. Um, so... Take these guys out pretty easily, there's a nice little treasure chest, secret up here with a bunch of money. Hopefully we can hold on, on onto a bunch of our money um, so we can make sure we can get our upgrades or our, our weapons upgraded. Now we're gonna do this. We got the skull. Yeah, he's dead. Up here. And fall right here. Okay. This one's actually kind of challenging just because of the nature of getting through these areas without getting hit um, and not getting pushed into any lava, which is, of course, a pain, but we'll see. Right, now, there are some secrets that they hide in here, uh, and you can't really jump on these things, so I gotta try and make it through this guy. Yeah, see, if you jump on that, they just disappear. So that's another little um, mix-up puzzle. And this is also interesting. <laughs> this, uh, this little dog thing, on top of being a pain in the ass, will give you a bunch of money. Um, so we're going to use our will right now. re heal myself a little bit. Uh, might as well top it off. Um, and we're going to do this. Get another skull, which I don't believe I got last time. Or I do, I remember the first time I played it, I didn't get it. I remember to find it next time after that, so now I do have it, which is good. Alright, let's go get this. All the money here. There's a skull right there, not very difficult to get to, luckily. Alright, walk right through here. Now, if you walk on them, it's good. If you fall on them, they, the, the really light yellow ones, they will bust you up, so... You gotta be real careful with that. Here. And as soon as this guy gets close, we can hop up. Get rid of him. Get our skull. Watch out for this guy to come through, because he's never really going to come through. Darkness is refilled, which is pretty sweet. And away we go. Now these things, I don't know if you guys played the original Shovel Knight, I hated the sections with this thing in it. Pissed me off to no end. Um, they're just really, really obnoxious. Ooh! That was extraordinarily lucky. Oh! Damn it. Well, we live, but I don't know how we're going to get back there without using him as a booster. I guess with using him as a booster. Alright, so here's one of the change mechanics. The uh, lamp right there is green. So instead of going through it the right way, you actually end up going through it the opposite way. Okay. A bunch more money. We still haven't lost it, which is awesome. I don't think I have enough will to uh, top off my health, but I need to use it soon. Alright, this guy has a full will right there. Okay. So we are going to grab the full will. Heal ourselves up twice. Fall right in, because awesome. Oh, and damn it, there's health right there. Of course there is. Okay, so we're gonna try and figure out where the sweet spot is for this. Alright, I gotta get across there and get up to avoid getting hit by him. There we go. Now you can't do anything about it. Fall in. There we go. Okay, cool. Took me a second there. Full that, though. We are full on darkness. Health is a little bit lower than I want it to be, but not a huge deal. So yeah, this changes up the, uh, the flow of things just a little bit, making things a little interesting as far as traversal, but I actually had less of a difficult time with this than I did with the um, the book areas, and this one's actually fun. I actually really enjoy this little puzzle right here. Makes me happy. So you come back up here, and you just boink, 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 
Boink. Alright, this is another one we gotta just time everything right. This guy's an idiot. Just let him do what he wants to do because he's stupid. Pop through here, watch out, make sure he doesn't turn into fire. Oh, shit. And this is the uh, where it gets interesting with how you jump. So you gotta be careful with your jumping patterns here because you can screw yourself. Now there's a secret up there, so we wanna make sure that we time this well. Oh, that's cheap. Make sure we time this well so we can get through there. So you can't waste that wall, basically. You get up here, and I believe there's another skull over here. You dig this up, get a bunch more money. Hopefully, you don't die. It's all about timing in this one, though. Flawless execution. A bunch more money. Like a lot of money. Alright, so let's get through here. Oh! Yikes. There we go. And one more good measure. Okay, now there's these two guys that are going to be stupid. We can hop through here and avoid them completely. Now this one is not hard, but a little bit of a, a trick here. you got to pop this thing, run in, and then run back. You don't really need this, but there is an enemy inside that thing. And they that will happen now for the rest of the area. As you can see in the bottom, that green one has uh, an enemy in it. Ah. Alright, I have full uh, will a uh, darkness on the top off my health real quick. Alright, so this one, you want to hit it and fall and run past it. So you don't trick yourself. Now there's that thing too. We're going to grab the checkpoint real quick. And some darkness. And pop over. You don't have to hit it on the way down. This The secret to this one is don't jump. Just fall through everything. Let that guy come to you. And see, that's what happens if you fall. But luckily, we killed him. I think I beat... Oh, I can't make it back, actually. I just realized that. Nah. We'll see if we can get through. I don't think you can jump off of it. No. Alright, I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. That's alright. Still, I'm still going to be dead, though. Okay, that's fine, though. We, we got the important thing, and uh, we didn't upgrade our... All right, well, I'll see if I can get my money back real quick. Um, I think I can, as long as I'm careful. Fall. Yeah. All right, yeah, I can get it back really easily. I just gotta be careful with the timing. There we go. All right, all our money's back. And we have the skull. Our enemy have the uh, coins upgrade. So what you're gonna do here is knock this in, turn the lava into regular goop, get that money. Or turn the uh, lava into green goop. Bounce off of this, so be careful. And then jump here. Hit this guy. Bounce off and grab that. Knock that into green goop. And come back around. And this one is an interesting one, too. You're gonna ricochet backwards. I really like the puzzles in this level a lot. Like, a, a whole lot. Hop on this. There we go. I think there's a checkpoint here, but we'll see. Now the green goop on this guy actually uh, knocks him back so much that his uh, defense gets broken, which is excellent. Um, so we're going to hop down here, and the next thing you got to do is knock this off, and make your way across in time to boost off of it backwards. Okay, here's a checkpoint. A little health that we don't really need, but no big deal. Let this guy come by. Alright, now. I'm going to time this right. There we go. Not a huge deal, I can still get up there. Yay! Alright. I still haven't found... I know I'm missing one of these damn secrets. I just can't figure out where it is. Oh, that's it. Oh, fuck. Ah, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Because I can't... Yep, I can't get back there, unfortunately. Yep. It's okay. It was a checkpoint right there, and we got the skull. Again, I, I would be upset, but, I mean, re the reality is you kind of... You sacrifice energy and lives to, to get some of these skulls. Just because the jumps are a little harder than they necessarily need to be. Um, but, whatever. Shit happens. Right, so I have that skull, so I don't have to worry about it next time. Just hop right through here. Uh, I wonder if I can ride that thing. Oh, shit. Alright, not a huge 
huge deal. I would have liked to have kept that money, but... Oh, no, no. He's dead. I'm still very concerned that I can't seem to find that last skull. <sighs> Alright, so this is an easy puzzle. Seems a little more difficult than it is, but it's not that hard. Hop off here, bounce up. There we go. And away we go. Now again, this one, you can see there's a bunch of uh, birds in this area. So we're going to wait for him to come back. Because i got to time that jump, or, or basically uh, run that jump as effectively as I can without freeing too many of them. Or I'll just free all but one of them, because that sucks. No, 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 get down. No, get down, dude. Alright, there's a secret here. Be careful, that's all about timing. Alright, we have, we're losing two. Alright. So again, we're missing just the one. Missing just the one. And I can't find it. Not for the life of me. Ha! Huh. Pisses me off a little bit, I gotta be honest with you. Well, here's Mole Knight. Um, Mole Knight is a little bit of a, a little bit of a challenge. He's more he's more difficult than King Knight, but still not terribly hard. So <clears throat> hopefully we can kill him pretty quickly and keep all our money, because we have a ton of money right now. now. He is a little more challenging with this stuff. because uh, those things used to be destructible walls that you couldn't really you didn't have to really worry about. And now you can't now you bounce off of him, so it's kind of a bit of a challenge and a pain in the ass, actually. You can still hurt him in this way, but he bounces everywhere, which is... That doesn't make things easy on you. I believe he drops the entire... There we go. I get a quick shot in on the there. I gotta monitor my health and be careful with that. There we go. Two hits left before I worry about this. One, there's two. Ah, shit. Got him again. Got him again. Alright, let me uh, top off my health a little bit. Oh! Came too fast at me. I think I should be able to kill him right now. There we go. Got him. Good thing. First try. Kept all our money. We're gonna get a lot more money out of this, too. Uh, 12 grand. We should be able to upgrade three of our um, special maneuvers, but there is a catch to this level. So we're back at the tower, right? Sorry to take a drink. Except, oh, we get some backstory. Luan. <clears throat> we're almost there, I can feel it. Donovan, indeed, in a long journey it's been. Onward. Press onward. So now, we are Spectre Knight before he was Spectre Knight. He was still alive. And here you get Caltrops, which are uh, kind of a cool F weapon. It depends how you use them, but you'll see. I'll drop them right here. See how that works. Yep, just takes out enemy. Basically leaves a Caltrop behind. Or kind of a Caltrop. Um, and your friend here, Luan, will uh, ricochet you up. So we're going to drop one of these things in this guy's head. <clears throat> Kill him real quick. My voice is going. Sorry about that, guys. And gals. Okay, so... I want to get back up this way. Get all that money. Oh, shit. No, nope, not that way. I want to get up there and get that. There we go. And we can do this. And cheese this guy. Bloop! Because he's dumb. He's very stupid. I don't need you anymore. Not right now, at least. I wonder if there's behind this wall. Nope. Seemingly not. Okay. So... Grab those two. Deft little bit of jumping there. Get our one checkpoint. And our little secret with the chicken. Ooh, I have money. I didn't I actually never found that one last time. That's kinda cool. Kill this guy. Got our powers back up. Gonna climb this wall, jump off of him. Just pepper this guy with caltrops because he's stupid. Just keep walking over them. 
get this money here. Grab this money. And all this money. We're actually in really good shape as far as money goes. Pretty stoked on that. Hop down here. And we are back at square one. So Luan, <clears throat> uh, what say we stop here for the night? Uh, Donovan, as a father, I'm worried about him. Do you think the amulet will truly protect him from all harm? Your boy has much to learn about this world, certainly. But if this trinket is as powerful as they say, I, I can only hope the legends hold true. Don't worry, we won't be leaving empty-handed. Come now, let's rest, and tomorrow we will find out for ourselves. So, I mean, I'm making the assumption that Donovan is Spectre Knight. It seems that way. Certainly got the same move set and all that stuff, otherwise it'd be weird. But we did miss one more of the skulls, and I just don't know where it is. It's pissing me off. I don't think there's anything he's got. Oh, he's got the Kronos coin, which slows everything down, but I don't have enough to get it yet. So we'll have to wait on that one. I'm not going to buy any armor, but I am going to go upgrade at least three of my weapons. So curios. All right, so first of all, throwing sickle, having the ability to get our money back that falls. For sure we're doing that. And the cool thing is it doesn't increase the cost. It's just that much money. So the Will Skull we're going to upgrade, so it gives us more health when we heal. And we're going to upgrade the uh, Shadow Mirror so that it's farther distance and picks up items, which is pretty cool. Alright, so, puppy, since I beat you before, do you have anything to say for yourself? It's not. Probably not, because I beat the crap out of him. <clears throat> Alright, let's fall down here. And we are ready to take on someone else. I've gotten no farther than this, so from now on, it's all as new to me as it is to you guys. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Right now, we're going to stop. We'll get. Uh, we'll pick our next uh, boss at the next level, the next video, rather. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I've been Bregadan. If you like what you saw here, give me a like or a sub. Uh, shoot me uh, some messages in the uh, comment section. Let me know uh, how I'm doing, what you think about the videos, and if you like Shovel Knight, uh, sh sh bleh, what's it called? The Spectre of Torment, uh, thus far. So, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. Adios, guys.